Jean Lee said he wasn't in a hurry, so if we went now, there's probably still time, right? Anyway, even if we don't make it, it's not our fault. He could have totally picked him by himself. Ugh. Anyway, let's go check with him at Wang Chung Funeral Parlor. Oh, all right. Let's take a break here. Oh, wow, look who it is. Are you here to hang out with everyone's favorite funeral director? So you're just casually practicing your rapping skills at the entrance to your funeral parlor? In broad daylight? <laughs> After everything we've been through, you don't see me for a hot minute, and you're back to being scared of your own shadow. We have all this open space, a clear view of the mountains behind and the sea in front. Not to mention we have several invisible audience members enthusiastically cheering us on. It's the perfect spot to rehearse. Invisible audience? Gotta say, it took me a few days to get used to Director Hu's way of talking. <laughs> Xin Yan was pretty spooked too when she first got here. Just like when she sees a frog, but a giant frog with sharp teeth. Come on, knock it off. What's wrong? I've never seen someone look so confused before. Well, don't worry, because Director Hu's here to explain it all. <clears throat> There once was a Fontaine musician who went around town on a mission. He came door to door for his iridescence tour, looking for acts to audition. With my words, Shin Yan's chorus and Yunjin as our mentor, we'll take the stage by storm with flames roaring and the whole audience calling for more. For sure! The whole dance floor will be yelling encore, encore! Oh, now Paimon's riding along. Um, but when you say flames roaring, are you sure this will be safe? <laughs> oh, don't you worry about that. I'm pretty experienced on the stage, and I've already informed the Yuhong of all the pyrotechnics we're planning on using. Huh. Guess we'll just have to trust Chin Yan on this one. Oh, Zhang Li. He took one of those fancy meal boxes and set off for the mountains. Said he wanted to pay a visit to some old friends. It's a real pity that he couldn't be around for this. As well as being a true connoisseur of traditional art forms, he's able to appreciate Shin Yan's performances too. Yeah, that's right. Matter of fact, he was the one who first invited me to perform here. To tell the truth, though, I never thought I'd really find myself rehearsing here one day. <laughs> well, now you know. The Wangsheng Funeral Parlor is a great location. All of you are always welcome to come and hang out here. Especially if you're in the mood to try something new. I can speak to that. Hu Tao is always full of fun surprises. And jump scares. Actually, Xinyan, I have some lyric ideas for your part. Do you want to go through the... Oh, sure thing. Oh, Traveler and Paimon, I believe Zhang Li was heading to Mount Hulao, so make sure you're hiking up the right hill. When you see Zhang Li, please pass on this message to him. It's up to him whether he wants to support us at the performance tonight. But I expect him to make time for the upcoming banquet we're planning. No excuses. You should join us too. It'll be a riot. If there's one thing I've learned from being a funeral director, it's how to throw a party. Okay, everyone. I think that's a long enough break. Let's take it from the top, shall we? Ugh, Ms. Yoon is such a strict mentor. 
these breaks aren't even long enough to have a sip of tea. <laughs> well, you were desperate to get involved, and this is what it takes. If I gave you half the chance, you'd be sipping tea till nightfall. Hey, how about I treat us all to some late night snacks once we're done? Hotel, what you craving? Hmm, how about some stir fried filet with a side of crab roe tofu? <laughs> Where are we gonna find crab roe tofu so late at night? We could always just go pester masterful chef Zhang Ling. Mm, now I'm hungry. All right, let's knock this out and then go grab some food. familiar face. Have you come from the Yue Harbor? How is the city nowadays? Everything's great! But you know, if you're so curious, you can always go and check it out for yourself. In fact, Moon Carver has been taking many walks on Mount Tianhang in recent times. I believe the sights of the city are quite familiar to him. Zhang Li! Here you are! We've brought the bamboo shoots you wanted. Impeccable timing. Traditionally, bamboo shoot soup ought to be slow cooked for many hours on low heat. Using Adeptus Arts to hasten the process is something of a shortcut. Wait, that mechanism, is that? Indeed, Cloud Retainer kindly lent me her supreme cuisine machine. Cooking machine? Ugh, actually, never mind. She seems to take a lot of pride in her mechanical gizmos, so it's probably best if Paimon doesn't go changing the name willy-nilly. I trust that you found the answers you were seeking during your recent journey? Excellent. The past should be remembered, but not overly dwelt upon. Our journey should be seen as a means to take on more from the world around us. When the bamboo shoot soup is ready, I must insist that you try some for yourself. Oh, Zhang Li, Hu Tao told us to tell you something. She said it's up to him whether he wants to support us at the performance tonight, but I expect him to make time for the upcoming banquet we're planning. No excuses. When she says performance, she must mean the Lantern Rite Music Festival. As for the banquet, uh... She didn't tell us anything more about that, but she invited us to come as well. As you can see, I have a prior engagement with two Adepti friends of mine tonight. Please, give Director Who my best wishes for the performance. As for the banquet, hmm, since the Director insists, far be it from a mere consultant like myself to refuse. Yay! Then we'll see you there? Absolutely. Rex Lapis, the bamboo shoot soup is ready. Thank you. I will examine it right away. Hmm. The appearance is exquisite, and the aroma rich and intense. The craftsmanship of this machine is commendable indeed. Since you came all this way, you should not leave empty-handed. Please, take some soup. It tastes most exquisite while still warm. <laughs> mm. 
I'm honored to be here on the Iridescence Tour stage. All right, without further ado, I'm Shinyan. This is Hitao, <laughs> and this is a little something called... <laughs> Does anyone have any plans tomorrow? With another year behind us, I think we deserve a celebration of our own. Mm. My treat. Interested? The Tian Xuan footing the bill? I can't miss out on that. <laughs> May the year ahead be a blessed one. I believe it shall be. Master, the Shao Lanterns, I... Ha! Elementary! One shall fashion for you a Shao Lantern the likes of which the world has never seen. And you must take it to Liyue Harbor to display its magnificence for all. 